the media gathered last night to welcome new Linnets manager Ian Culverhouse to the club and grill him on where he plans to take them. Well, it's about creating momentum. Uh, I don't want the, I don't want the uh, season to fall flat uh, and we just roll. Uh, it just dies away. Uh, the team, the team have gone unbeaten for a while now, eight games. Uh, we've got a hell of a game at the kitchen uh, that I know the boys will raise the game again too. And it's about both sides learning each other. The club decided to employ Norwich City legend Ian Culverhouse as their new manager. It comes after Gary Setchell was sacked on Tuesday night. Culverhouse made almost 300 appearances for Norwich City over a nine-year career and almost 100 appearances for Swindon Town. He joins the Linnets from Dagenham and Redbridge where he's been an assistant manager since last January. I've, I enjoyed my time when I was at Norwich there in the Norfolk area and now I'm back again now and I would love to achieve the same success that I had at Norwich at this football club. Stephen Cleave is owner of the club. Well, simply what happened was Gary asked for a contract about, uh, I wanted to say five or six weeks ago, four weeks ago, that kind of, between four and six weeks ago. Um, and at that point, I never thought about giving Gary a contract because I never, you know, just, he has never had a contract here in seven years. So why would he suddenly need one? So that made me think, um, is he the right man? Uh, to take this football club to the next level. And not just that, is he the right man to take it to the next level up after that? Um, and I came to the conclusion over you know, a very harrowing four weeks for me, it really was a difficult decision, that he wasn't the right man. Ian is excited for the new challenges the club brings him.